Hi, it's Quinn, and I'll be reflecting on the first hiking trip. Uh, my physical limits were pushed on both days of the trip, but it was more pushed on the second day of the trip. Since there were uh, there was a lot of going up hills compared to the first day, plus my leg weren't feeling great from the walk on the first day, and the bag I was carrying was heavier because uh, we decided to split the tent. My leg were dying and it felt heavy when I reached the water station at the Buddha statue. My walking pace was slowly decreasing but I have to maintain the pace because there's still a long way to go to reach the top. However, uh, my mental limits were pushed on the first day due to my hiking group getting lost and going off track. I was feeling stressed and there were there was a lot of tension when my group made decisions because we made a lot of mistakes navigating the hike which led us to having to walk longer distance. I can keep challenging myself for the next uh, hike by keeping a steady pace for the whole duration of the hike and shortening the amount of breaks during the hike. This will allow me to cover a longer distance within the 8 hours time span. And for the next hike in Xing Rai, I'll prepare the same food for dinner uh, and breakfast, which is cod roll pasta for dinner and oatmeal for breakfast. However, this time I'll bring um, spam and I'll bring more dry fruits. Since these food taste good and it gives the nutrition we need, I'll also pack everything in the lightest and most compact way. So. I won't have to carry a bag that is heavier than it should be. The most difficult part of my group's hike is navigation. It is uh, literally the thing that is holding my group back because we made so many navigation mistakes that it, it added an extra 6 kilometers to our hike on the first day. How my group maintains friendship in difficult times is by staying calm and being positive about situations. My group didn't get into uh, any argument at all, so maintain, maintaining our friendship is pretty easy. I feel like it is important to work together um, because working as a team can reduce stress and lower the risk of getting lost. There will be more ideas and opinions, so making decisions can be easier. Everyone in the group has stepped up during uh, times of difficulties. During times where we were lost, Aki always led us back to the trail. Sandy and Gemma always have extra snacks during time I'm low on snacks. And I'm like the medic of the group because I carry medicines and a lot of plasters for the group, which becomes very handy when someone in the group gets blisters. The bear claw on the trees is something that starts a conversation because we were surprised to see it on uh, the trekking area. And it was uh, probably one of the highlights of the trip. Uh, training to jump higher is what I do for personal training. And it helps me prepare for hiking because training to jump higher help improve my leg strength. Uh, leg strength is something that is important for hiking. And um, it felt amazing when I finished the hike. Uh, there are a lot of memorable moments that happen and it just feels great to finish the hike without getting injured.